what's up gamers welcome back to another video it's me again and and today today we had cross country high school and i came third i came third i came third i came third look it, it says it on my wrist i came third three i was the third one to finish the thing and i was racing against other kids as well it was only year nines and the year tens all at once well the year nines nine girls and the year ten girls we all raced we all raced we did two laps around the thing and it was 2.4 kilometers i finished in 10 point 10 minutes 46 seconds and i came third and i came third i came third i came third the reward was was personal satisfaction, but it was much more than that to me, because Mr. Ladder congratulated me, and I got to talk to him about it, and 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 I was really happy, and he seemed happy for me too. Yay, um, um, and then and then I went home. Well, actually, no, I did not go home. Um, my mother, my mother, she, she told me that if I got in the top five, then I can get a can of monster energy. And I did, I, I got third. I, I came third. I came third. So I, I got a can of monster. I got a can of original no sugar. My favorite. And then we, I, I, I was able to get pizza. Because I told my mom that I didn't have lunch because I didn't. And I, I, I got pizza. I got pizza instead. I went and... I went into the the pizza place, my favorite pizza place, and I ordered my favorite pizza, the cheeseburger pizza, and I had that, and I I drank my can of uh, original no sugar most energy. And and I came third. I came third. I I. It, it's crazy to believe that last year, or actually only a few months ago, actually, last year, I hated running so much. I, like, legit, the thought of doing exercise whatsoever, it, it made me feel sad. I would cry if I had to run. But look at me now. I came third. I came third in cross country. I came third in cross country against the older kids. Um... And I think that this really shows how my hard work has paid off. Because I know that you guys, I've told you guys a lot about my running journey and how I, how I, how December 16th, 16th last year, I began running, running a lot every day on my treadmill. But then my treadmill exploded. I'm still grieving over that. I'm still crying over that. But I get to go to the gym now. And that's cool. I get to run. I get, I get to continue running now, and I get to be an amazing runner, and I, I should run a marathon. I should. Um, and then, that was, so we had cross country period four, and then we had, we had break. And that's when I got to talk to Mr. Ladder. That was nice. And then, and then period five, we went back. Like you all of all of the year nines and all of the year tens, we went back to the place and we all did the the we all did we we did it again. We did not need to do it two, two laps. We only did it one lap. We only did one lap. It was one point six one point two kilometers, and and we got to walk it. I was gonna run it, but then I saw my best friend Azaria, and. She wanted to walk because she doesn't like running, and so we walked together, and I got to talk to her. But I came third. In year four, the highest that I've ever, ever and the highest that I've ever actually gone in cross country, non-competitive, just normal cross country. In year four, I I came fourth. I came fourth. That was in twenty nineteen. I came fourth. But now, today, 2024, five years later, I came for I came third. I came third. Everyone is very proud of me. No, because, like, you see, I'm actually so happy that I came third. It's literally the only thing that I wanted. Because, you see, the thing, like, if, if I'm speaking on the first note, like, let's say, if, like, I, I, I don't want to be first. 
because like say if you're boasting like going around and boasting about it like being like yo i came first i came first i came first i i don't want to appear like i i would feel like i'm being like too condescending you know what i mean and if i came second and boasted about being second then people would be like sad and they would just be like oh damn you were so close to getting first you were so close to winning and I disregard the fact that you actually made it that high. But, you see, three three is perfect. Getting third is perfect. Because you're still on the podium, right? You still get your, to have your picture taken. Um, and then everyone's just like, whoa, you got first, cool. You're on the podium. And they don't care that you did not get first or second. And you don't seem condescending. And they actually acknowledge that you did it, that you ran fast enough to get on the podium without being... Um, condescending about it. That's why I like being third. This has worked out perfectly. I am so happy. I am so happy. I am so happy. When I when I got third, when I finished, I after I caught my I, <clears throat> after I had crossed that finish line, and got the number three written on my hand, on my wrist, and I, briefly, I spent a wee while catching my breath, and then I jolted off to the side, in which I proceeded to jump up and down and up and down and up and down, lonely, stating, I came third, I came third, I came third. I came third, while jumping up and down and up and down and up and down. Nobody noticed, I don't think, well, I don't think they noticed. No one else noticed, but I was happy. And then, and then, a few minutes later, we got to go back to school, and it was break. So I went back into my, to my forum class because I wanted to see Mr. Ladder and tell him about my epic victory. Uh, however, he was very busy dealing with another student. So I just kind of crouched down in the corner at the back of the classroom and waited till he had finished talking. It took a while, so I decided to read my book. In the meanwhile, but then I, I, I jolted up when the time was right and I went up to him and I jumped up and down a billion times, and I said, Guess what place I came? Guess what place I came? Guess what place I came? With a massive smile, smiling ear to ear, ear to ear. And he seemed happy, and I was happy. And, and I told him that I had come third. Because I came third. And that was cool, because I didn't know anyone else that did the competitive one. I, I mean, I think I saw another kid from my old school, but I did not race against him, because he is a male, and I raced against the females. So it was kind of just me. Me, myself, and I. Nobody else really knew who I was. And then at the end of the school day, we were all gathered together, everyone was gathered together, and I got to stand up and they all applauded for me. I did not get a standing ovation, but I did get a sitting ovation, and that's good enough for me. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all the latest updates. Bye guys!